Jeremy Goose is a little baby goose. Well, it's not a baby anymore because it grew up and it became a goose. But it was a very, very cute baby, yellow, fluffy, cute. And uh, so it was here in this park and uh, I saw it when it was very, very little, uh, maybe a day or two, uh, just fresh from the egg. And it had uh, parents, a family, and then, uh, you know, I, I followed Jeremy when he was growing up. Uh, I had uh, many, many pictures of Jeremy for months, for I think uh, the period of, uh, it takes like four or five months for a baby goose to grow into an adult. And I went, uh, I came here in the park every day for all this time to photograph him and his family. And so I have, um, oh look at the squirrel. Um, I have um, many, many photos of, of Jeremy and family and with different, uh, at different stages of his life. Very tiny little fluffy yellow ball and then he became an adolescent with really strange and funny, like ugly duckling almost. And, um, and then when I had all these photos and I looked at all them and I saw the story there, the story of his life. And then I arranged the photos, the, the best one, I chose the best photos, made the selection and, uh, and uh, with the progression of his life. And uh, I put them in the form of a book, seeing the progression of his relationship with his uh, family and, uh, and his becoming independent and uh, big. Okay, so there is a mom and dad, uh, and you can really see the dad is big and powerful, and the mom is very attentive. And at first, they were very, very close to him, the mom, all the time, you know, close to him. First time he went on the water, um, he was like touching the back of his mom, you know, he was a tiny little thing, and and she, uh, she swam, and he, he was against her, and uh, and then uh, the, the the dad was quite present, and uh, and and we would see sometimes Jeremy further away from his mom and dad, trying things, and the dad was looking at him, you know, you know, like uh, scolding him or something, you know, you know, like a parent should do, and there were others there. Uh, you know, other geese, and I think they are aunts and uncles, and grandpa was a little bit different. Uh, this is what was striking when I, I saw the photos, because when I'm photographing, really, I, I just sh shoot, 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 and then I understand better what's happening after, calmly, I look at my photos, and I see how attentive they were. Uh, and and how disobedient sometimes he was, yeah. you know, yeah. and and sometimes they, they they were running after him to bring him back or I don't know. And then I interpreted their animal gestures. They have their own reasons, but I interpreted it, uh, you know, as a human and uh, you know, a story of a of a child growing up in a in a family. Yeah, it shows. Uh, it shows like a. You know, it's a, it's a good thing to uh, be curious and maybe try adventure, but with the limits that the parents impose because it's for their safety. And uh, I think Jeremy understands, well, in the story, Jeremy understands that very well. You know, he tries things, maybe a little bit dangerous, and then he's put back to, uh, you know, a behavior that doesn't put him into danger and this is a good lesson and you know listen to the parents uh, who protect you yeah. and still be curious yeah. for adventure